This is the uh, dispatch center here for Tampa Electric. It's where Matt LaRusso will be if a hurricane threatens the Tampa Bay area. It's a center for all power restoration activities after a storm. All right, so we got to wire down, and that's going to be Even today, they are taking customer calls, dispatching crews, and watching, making sure the power stays on. It's almost uh, a daily event. You know, we have these afternoon thunderstorms that come through. And when they do, the strong winds can knock over trees and take down lines, disrupting service. We had one here just on May 20th where we had 25,000 customers out. So every stormy day here in the Energy Control Center is helping with their preparation. We feel like we're very uh, ready here to, um, to help with restoration. Tampa Electric invests nearly $40 million to protect the system against severe weather. They do everything from maintaining the 2,000 miles of power lines to replacing old wooden poles that are no longer safe. In this case, they're using metal that is more likely to be able to handle the stronger winds. Another tool to help restore the power is this bucket truck. Powered by battery, it enables workers to start work on the lines without the truck running. There we go. So back inside the ECC, Tico can keep an eye on all the power and work every day to be ready. We see our share of outages and we work, you know, safely and efficiently to get our customers restored. Take it in, we'll get one out there for you. In Tampa, Paul Lamison, News Channel 8.